these ice cream truck drivers drive by my house every day. And I just started working from home and I noticed they started driving by my house every day, same time of day, all the time. I hear Christmas music, I hear jingle bells, and I'm kind of starting to get annoyed. They're really starting to bother me. I really need to find out some answers. So my goal is to answer these questions. Why do they play Christmas music in the middle of the summer? Why are they just in one location? Do they get annoyed listening to the music all day? Do you have some type of like strategic route that you go to, like schools and then parks and then, I, you know, we live by a park. Did you hear that? Oh, I thought I heard one. Do they go to some type of like ice cream truck convention? Where do they get that music? It's so annoying. How long does it take to become an ice cream truck driver? I mean, really, to become a great ice cream truck driver. I hear one now. Let's go. Okay, so we just ran out here to answer the questions. We, we heard the ice cream truck, but he's gone now. So we're going to have to wait a few more minutes. Um, he comes by every five or ten minutes. So once he comes by, we'll get him. I don't get this. So we, we just saw him go by and, and he's coming back again. So I am pumped because we are going to get these questions answered. Let's go. He didn't stop. located the ice cream man. She's talking to him to get him back over here. He's coming over. And we were gonna pay him because it's his business and he doesn't want to do it for free. Hello, hi. I'm the ice cream man. I have a question though. Yeah. About the music. Uh -huh. Does it drive you crazy? Yeah. yeah. Where do you buy that music? It's a music band. Uh-huh. Yeah, you have only uh, two or three songs on it. Uh-huh. Yeah. Only three? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's only three dollars. You guys have, thank you. So you guys have vendor or your own like customers? Because yeah, of we have them. our own customers because like, like we're, we're younger. So I don't know. If it's yeah, we met a couple of the other older guys. Yeah, there's yeah. a lot of older, other older people. Yeah. How long you guys have had the truck? Like For over three years. Okay. And is it like a family thing? Yeah, it's a family thing. Okay. So you guys are all brothers and sisters? How about like the competition? Do you guys have like other vendors that... Yeah, there's a lot of competition, but um, everybody like, you have your own customers because of your prices and like the way you serve them, so... So, do you guys have like a strategic, strategic group that you go? Like... Yeah, I actually go um, from Coronado, I mean from Palms to Coronado and then just like Buyer, and okay. then just around that area, the so lower, like all the near houses. the parks, near the parks, and the schools. Yeah, the schools. Okay. And then the music. Does the music drive you crazy? No, it doesn't. You just get used to it. Really? Yeah. And, I, and actually, we have um, thirty two songs, and I only just like the music. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you so much. You're we welcome. Thank you. Good luck. so excited we finally found tracked down our one last vendor that circles the block she was very hopeful she answered all of basically all of our questions and we're eating ice creams I felt like today was a great day learning about the ice cream truck vendors mm, it's good.